assalamu alaikum everyone welcome to today's jasmine video updates straight from the smartphone trading view okay because of the laptop issues that i'm having but anyway uh it's okay there's no issue so uh previously in the in the previous updates if you're aware we talked about the three line strike and uh let's go back to google and let's do a little bit of googling so that we can refresh the concept so what i'm gonna do is three line strike pattern and uh, i talked about this one in detail i wasn't sure if it was bearish or bullish but if you actually look at it this way when you see three black rows back to back and then one big huge green candle to the upside that makes it a bearish pattern if you just look at the writing here it's bearish okay it says bearish so uh going back to the chart all we see uh, uh or what you just saw here is uh the three black rows right over there and uh from that three black rows ladies and gents we had this one big huge green candle making it a three line strike pattern and you can already see it it, it really is a bear pattern so the people who say that trading doesn't work just look at that yes it does work and uh, it's actually a continuation to go to the downside now the, uh, the the only meaningful support as i spoke in the previous video is the low right here and uh, by the looks of bitcoin a lot of coins are not really looking good to go to the upside but there's one more thing that i actually want to talk about and that's the uh, sandwich stick pattern that is actually bullish and uh, i'm just going to tell you why this could actually be bullish and not bearish at all um yes i'm just gonna surprise you here you know just b before you get bearish and think that it's gonna dump to the downside there could be a bullish pattern printing out on the bullish uh, on the on the weekly time frame okay i just said bullish time frame okay so here we are and uh, let's go on here and let's search for a uh, stick sandwich pattern so uh, this is it looks like and from here as a matter of fact i'm going to open up this one so so the, the the black that you see is the red the white that you see is the green so red in the middle there's a green and then in the red there is a uh, in the in the third one there's a red so it makes it a sandwich that the green is sandwiched between the two reds so if you go back to the charts you're really doing the same thing okay the red one the green one and then you have the red one once again so it actually makes it a stick sandwich pattern and uh, it could be bullish now for that one you still have to put a one big stop loss down somewhere here which is going to be at the 171 level okay so it, it would be a good idea to actually put in a trend line right over here as a support if you start to close below uh, this trend line as a matter of fact and that's gonna be a very big issue for Jasmine uh, somewhere down here nearly this 183 180 level if you start to close below the 180 level on a higher time frame then potentially you're gonna drop even way more farther now that's actually in the higher time frame let's dive into the dailies and uh, let's see what's going on okay so uh, the, the story you can see that potentially on the daily you're making a falling wedge and when you're making a falling wedge you're potentially going to put that stick sandwich which is a bullish pattern by the way and uh who knows you can start to break out of the falling wedge so time is the time is near uh, the time will tell it's even way more clear on the four hour time frame i actually showed you this uh, previous drawing in the previous videos as well all you did is, is you went to the upside came down go up came down go up came down went up maybe come down again do you see that 180 level that i just draw for you and then you might break out of the falling wedge and you go to the upside again to 280 levels it's it's possible but time will tell it's all about breaking and back testing and holding support and not losing support if you do that amazing uh so we we're gonna have to wait we, weekend is upon our heads and uh, it's not a good idea to trade on weekend and bitcoin is not looking so friendly so be careful in this space and uh yeah if you want to learn trading do check out my trading course the link is in the des description and do tell me in the comments do you like this phone version of the update is it okay did you like the experience or not because sometimes some of you are on the phone most of you are on the phone i just realized and it's a good idea to actually you know trade through the phone as well so that you can understand how trading works on the on the phone side of it you know how to use the tools on the phone efficiently so that's it i'm gonna see you in the next one i love you